Welcome to my lore through of Elden Ring. I have been carefully going through the map of the Lands Between, trying to find all the secrets and all the different storylines. And if this is something that you're interested in and you enjoy, follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash rodscaden. The link will be in the description. And if you do enjoy these kinds of videos, please subscribe. It helps a lot. And I will be making a lot more of these because I'm just getting started with the game. Having said all of that, Enjoy the video. I am no longer naked at all. I am just Bushman now. I will always be Bushman. But my nakedness is far gone at this point. Okay, so we explored... We explored a lot. We even came came up to here. I guess, mm, I guess we do need to explore the town. And that would possibly lead us to Stormwind right here. But the town, technically, I think it, they're still counting it as East Limgrave. But there's also the beaches here that I haven't explored at all that I do want to check out. Do you have anything else, Anna? About Blade? Who's Blade? Ah, then you met Blythe, did you? Blythe. Wonderful. I'm glad I pointed you in his direction. Oh. He's boorish, blunt, and couldn't find his nose with both hands. But he's a good egg. <sighs> I think the two of you are sure to find the best in one another. He's the wolf guy. He's really cool. Blade is wolf in Welsh. That's cool. But yeah, the, there seems to be like a lot of Welsh. There's a lot of Welsh NPCs. Yeah, and there's a lot of Welsh terms in general. I've been seeing random parallels to different things for a while now, and I'm just kind of curious where they're going to fall into. <gasps> oh, this is how you get to the room. Maybe I won't explore there. <sighs> Can I get there? Turns, okay, no I can't. No, I cannot. There's one thing that I thought is really interesting is that beaches in different countries look completely different. The beaches here have been way more vertical. Horse, you don't have the right. What I was familiar with, beaches were very gradual and very long. Coastal cave. That looks like a foot right there. Shh, shh, shh. Push man. Uh oh, uh oh. No, I wanted the big guy. I wanted the big guy. <laughs> oh, the summons! Okay, yeah. <laughs> I forgot about the summons. Uh, yeah, I have I have my wolfies. Yeah, those are ashes. Lone wolf. Summon three wolves. <laughs> well, it's because of the lone wolf shirt. Have You know, the three wolves lone wolf shirt that everyone wears? Let's go, doggos! Ooh! Here we go. Here we go. Let's clean it out. Tailoring tools, sewing needle. I have a three chicken moon shirt. You know what, that's pretty fitting. <laughs> I didn't even know they made a three chicken moon shirt. But now I kind of want to see it. What is this cave? Usually these caves don't keep on going. Oh. I was not expecting being sent here. Oh, a little penguin. Why are there so many penguins here? Oh, there's something up there, or is that just a message? Far to the east, you'll find the Cathedral of Dragon. To the east? Oh, there's something over there. Is that boats? Is it breathing? Church of Dragon Communion. And one thing that I did think was interesting in this lore versus the Dark Souls is that, at least from what they've said so far, it seems like in this, the dragons served the humans. Whereas in Dark Souls, the humans dethroned the dragons. Harry Potter! Um... Well, that'd do. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to come back here when I have, like, a dragon medallion. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. 
I have a dragon heart. Yeah, but I wonder, I wonder then, I wonder if it, you do have to find a different altar first to be able to come back. You know what? I hadn't really stopped to think about, but like people were being all like modern open world games. You need to have climbing. You need to have swimming. That's, you know, what made Breath of the Wild great, but this game excels without either of those. <gasps> Wait, isn't there a big knight here? The dude that killed me for the first time I played the game? Let's see. Let's see. Hello, big guy. I have a horse now. Oh, how do I do this? Uh-oh. I think he just pulled my horse. Wolf time! Wolfies, no! No, my wolfies! You will be avenged. You will be avenged! No, don't you dare kill me, last one. What's that? Hopefully it's not a baddie. Oh, I can't examine it. Let's see, what is this? Examine? Oh. Guide and gatekeeper for the- for those returning to the roots. There be rump. Navigate the storm foot catacomb. Oh look, it's a ghost now. With a lot of blood around him. Death ahead. A proper death means returning to the earth tree. Have patience until time comes and a roach call to you. Hey! Prattling Pate, hello. <gasps> no, no! I, I kind of like the older ones. Like, hello! <laughs> that one's kind of creepy. And what better time to look at things than right now? Clump of small stone with smoldering core explodes when thrown together at an enemy inflicting fire damage, and that's pretty useful. Miners employ these stones as tools for rock blasting, but have long forgotten how to craft them. What? Piece of glintstone tinged with unstable magic found in crystal tunnels. Uh, poor quality, thereby easily broken. Now these two, shard of rock found in the wake of a meteorite strike. It is imbued with a particularly weighty magic. The desperate ones who scavenge for these shards dub themselves star callers. Eggs of large crabs which dwell in the shallows, a nutritious food stuff that warm from within. Flavor is exquisite. Only those of comfort and means know the truth. A crab's eggs are more delectable than the meat. Puffy, milky, white, or oh, uh, of a land octopus. Oh, it's goop. The white part is goop. I didn't even realize. Land octopuses eat humans in order to bear young. And theirs is the blood that runs through their ovaries. Purple flower that blooms in graveyards. Material used for crafting items. The hue of ghost flame. The hue of ghost flame, it's believed to be useful for calling forth spirits. I'm adding this one because I feel like if we see purple flowers in a place that isn't a grave, it would be really interesting. The Erdsteel daggers, a grass crest engraved upon its blade, carried by the Erdtree royalty for self-defense in times of peace. Though forged to a high standard, the weapon is difficult to wield. Attack power also scales with fate. This hammer, large iron war hammer designed for gladiatorial combat, used by duelists who were exiled from the Colosseum. Whenever someone says exiled, I kind of need to add it. Because <laughs> once I get to the place, I'm, there might be like stuff about exiles. A weighty halberd forged of gold, wielded by the Order of Tree Sentinels, heavily equipped knights, deals holy damage. Masterfully crafted weapons that 
lives up to its heft. It is difficult for one mere human to human strength to wield. And the Golden Vow. Skill passed down from antiquity among the knights of the capital. Raise armament aloft and pledge to honor the Erdrian battle. Did we read the turtle? Talisman shaped as a green turtle. Raises stamina recovery speed. Turtles are known for as a nutritious ingredient, symbolic of inexhaustible power. However, those who hold turtles to be wise creatures consider the practice of eating their meat to be barbarous. Looks really cool. That's cool. That's so cool. <laughs> Look at that thing. <laughs> that is so cool. Oh, it's terrifying. It's terrifying. It's not cool. I don't like how it moves. It's hilarious. Look at it. <laughs> Okay, no. <laughs> it is not a statue. Oh, another one of these. I wonder what this is. This is not the first time we've seen something like this. It's like the tree... Oh... Are these the roots of the Erd tree? That would be interesting, because this would have very interesting... Whee! This guy over here. <laughs> would have very interesting implications. We didn't finish the Limgrave Tunnels. You know what, let's go finish Limgrave Tunnels. I'm going right to the boss. Watch this be locked. Imagine this is locked. Oh, it's one of you. Oh, I don't have I don't have my horse, do I? Hit me. Come on. Oh, that was close. That was really close. <laughs> There's always one attack. That will freak me out. It's always towards the end. I feel like sometimes you get a little bit bold towards the end and that's when the, this game gets you. This entire series is made so that you get a little bit too bold and you die. Oh. Oh, is it coming from that one strand of... What? I'm sorry, goat. You, you started this. You have used the word ban. I will set a timer. Five minutes, is it? So how are you gonna get him to say it? I, I just won't. <gasps> you, uh... <sighs> Thought you were my friend. See, I have only enemies here. I'm just gonna say subjects now. Hot, man, backstab, nope. Failure. Yeah, that was that was pretty good. That was pretty good. I have to I have to say I wasn't expecting it. My brain is hurting. I'm trying to figure this out. This is the area we've been to already. It has to be. Because I think I think that was T O O or the number, the number two? Number two. Number two's fine. This is not gonna end. Talk like caveman. Talk like bushman. A company ledge. I see glow. Glow. If anyone comes into... If anyone comes in, they'll think I'm crazy. That's a mean word. Golden rune. Golden rune. That's pretty good. Needed to make sure. New pointing man. I wonder if he point same location. Oh, already done. I kill every beast except for turtle. Anyways, I gotta go bed. Goodbye. Have fun. Close. I'm sweating. The game hasn't made me sweat, but the challenge has. House. Painting? I think I know where that is. Right here. We'll do this later. Man on a mission. I did it! 
And that was a lot more difficult than I thought it would be, if I'm being honest. That's the thing, though, like, you don't use two as much as you think you do, but you do at odd times, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Who's hearing that? Maybe before I check this area out, I should check whatever it is that's making that sound up there. Whatever's happening there, it sounds real bad. <laughs> it sounds real bad. That was good. No. No. <laughs> no, it wasn't. It's so weird talking now. I feel like I'm thinking about my every word. I think this is gonna lead us out of Limgrave, though. Oh, and you can climb up from here. Oh, and here's the ocean. That's interesting. This is an interesting place on the map. There's a camp, though. And whenever we approach a camp, it's time for Bushman. There's a sad man. Sad mans are not either friends or enemies of Bushman. Sad mans are neutral. You could have some good sad mans. You could have some bad sad mans. Are you a living sad man? No. No! This is an evil sad man. High Road Cave. I really like these little dungeons that they have. They're such a nice little bite-sized... ...gears. <gasps> this is like a clock tower of some- This is ex I'm already excited. I love me some gears. I'm for Sniper. Sniper, no sniping! Seems like an actually big place. Yeah, no, it does. It's really cool. I feel like in previous games, I rarely use the bloodstains, but I'm finding that in this game, it has been way more useful. Ooh, that looks really cool. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I bet this is the toilet from the castle. Where are we on the map? Oh no, this is from the... Okay, so they're all trying to do that one. That one, not the way. This one, possibly the way. No, 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 no. Dun, dun, da, da, dun, dun, da, da, dun, dun, da, da, dun, dun. There we go. A sham share. I mean, I might as well do this. Big boy. Hello, big guy. Ooh, lava. Yes, wolf! Wolf! <laughs> You're the best, buddy! You're the best! You did it! You are the lone wolf. He's a good boy. He would have to eat so much to survive as a giant. Yeah, the practicality of it is not really there. Why are there always one of these? What do we have here? I'm glad we came back. There's some interesting stuff here. So I could see this being some sort of set old ceremonial area. Now it is interesting to think then about the giant, because he could have been placed here. I wonder if it has anything to do with these. It could be also some sort of like something to do with the with the bridge. So he could be protecting something. And it is very close to this structure. The bridge also follows that same architecture style. Or maybe it's a waterway system. Maybe it was originally a waterway system, given this. This is very much like waterway. So maybe this was some sort of sewer system? A cistern? Could be a cistern? Could be a few different things, but it does seem like it was some sort of water-related contraption of some sort, or system. 